everybody. Welcome back. Yes, I missed you guys so much. I'm just coming straight in. This is March Energy Reads. Pisces, you are up. Happy birthday, guys. Okay. First up. So, um, General Read takes us for you. Leave the rest behind. Pisces, however, applies in your chart. Okay, guys. General message. Pisces, beautiful things coming in. All right. We're going to just go straight in. Like, I feel that there were so many people who doubted you. And I feel like you just, a lot of you guys, you know, were working on this behind the scenes. Some of you probably even could have doubt, doubted yourself or felt like something wasn't going to happen. But majority of you, you know, you just kept manifesting. You kept working on it. You know, you kept thinking outside of the box. You didn't allow closed mind people to stop you from moving forward and working on what it is that you felt like you can accomplish. And let me tell you, I feel like it's coming in. Okay. The shit is coming in. Um, while I was going through your pre-shuffle, and meditating on your energy, I did feel the need to say that, you know, a lot of you guys, you cannot speak up about what it is that you have coming in towards you because a lot of people aren't, um, yeah, they're not as excited about what you got coming in. They're not as enthusiastic, rather, is the word, okay? Um, they're watching this transformation happen, and let me just tell you, there are not people who are, like, happy. There are really people who didn't think that you would make it. Okay, but you are going to succeed. You are going through a beautiful transformation. Got Scorpio energy around you. Okay, Pisces, your own energy here. Thank you, Spirit, as we open up. Oh, you got two cards here. You have great adventure. Uh, a adventure. Okay, so um, some sort of accent, you know, picking up foreign. Or you could be in some sort of southern state. I'm picking up like ranch, a ranch style type of environment, you know. Farmer. Okay, farmers only, whatever. But great adventure. Take a risk, adventure forward. I feel like you guys have done that, okay? That's not going to cut it, Jess. Let's not even go there. But um, yes, and then you have narrow path. Tread thoughtfully. Like I said, a lot of you guys, you took the time. You didn't, you know, doubt yourself. You believed in it. You kept manifesting what it is that you wanted. You put in that work, okay? You took the risk. And I feel like things are starting to pan out. Um, with this grounding energy here, go deep, explore your roots. You guys knew that this was coming. You knew that it would happen eventually. I feel like for a lot of you guys, you didn't think it would happen as soon as it is happening. But baby, it is coming in, especially with this magician energy sitting under here, Gemini Virgo energy. Mm, big bucks too. Real good stability here. Something where you could just sit back and relax, okay? But like I'm saying, it ain't for everybody. You're going to have people coming in. Acting like they was there with you in the gym. They definitely were not. They left you hanging. Okay. Let them folks go. But yeah, this is all on, you know, your hard work. <coughs> mm. <clears throat> That's what I'm saying. Like, you can't speak up about this to everybody. Okay. Like, that tread thoughtfully. Like, you need to be very cautious about who it is that you speak up to about your successes here. And what it is that you're accomplishing. Okay, even the people, okay, the people that, mm, mm -hmm. the people that you felt were there to support you, they're not. It's like very much so a very flighty type energy that you were dealing with. Okay, might as well keep it going, Sarah. These people want to keep you trapped in your head and still make you feel like you're not capable. But I feel like you guys are grounded because you know that what is for you is meant. Like, I'm really picking up that strong energy there. Like, you know the value of you. You know how much work you've put in. You know the effort that went into what it is that you're doing. Yeah, and like, this wanted to pop out in your pre-shuffle. You know that this opportunity is coming in towards you. And like I said, the good shit is coming. Like, you, you feel it. I feel like... um. You could be dealing with an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Like I said, we I, second time saying Gemini. Um, but the energy is to keep you trapped. I'm also feeling that you need to keep yourself kind of trapped or whatever. Like, stay hush about this. Keep people guessing. Because you got flighty people. Like I said, folks who feel like they was there with you in the gym. Yeah, because this is what I want to know about facts. These are people who... They want to come and act like they was um putting in that work with you. Like, they want to wear the crown with you, but the crown can only fit one hat. You get me? And that's you who manifested these things, all right? Advice here for my Pisces. What is that with you guys? Yeah, but... Mm-hmm. Keep them caught up in the head, okay? Like, these people really don't care about you. Like, they just want to come back and leash off you, and they want to keep you stuck... 
I'm hearing the phrase, they want to see you do good, just not better. Like, this is that strong energy there, okay? Like, people who want to pull you back, like, play into the game if that's what they want to do or whatever. But you know the truth about these people as well, okay? You also know that these folks, that they flighty, they in and out, they don't wish you the best, okay? They want to see you tied down and stuck. Like, these people, I feel like, have hurt you before. Like, they come in and out your life only when you have something or, that is of value to them. And I feel like it's ideas. These people come in and they steal your ideas, okay? Like, I feel like you could be... I'm picking up, like, entrepreneurial type energy here. Like, when you have all these great ideas and you go and you tell them to folks and people run off with your junk and get it popping before you or whatever. I feel that they don't succeed on an account that they always come back to you for more information. And it's like you keep giving it to them. You need to stop giving these people advice. Stop giving them your ideas. It's time for you to set forth and start putting in your own energy. Like, you need to start taking action on these ideas, okay? I feel like you can, like, with that Five of Swords energy, because you know the games that they're coming back to play, go ahead, okay? But you know at the end of the day that these people are going to hurt you, okay? You have to decide to let these people go and how much energy you want to give into these folks. Yeah, how much energy and how much you want to give into these folks. I feel like these people probably pull at your heartstrings. You have a really strong emotional connection to these folks. But yeah, with this tower energy under here, you got to let this go. You can't keep giving into these people, all right? Let them keep guessing. Let them figure something out on their own, okay? It's time for you to move forward. I also feel like you're valuing... The opinion of others for some of you guys, you know, and the plays on you emotionally. Mm hmm. Your, your problem here is being able to move forward with this cancer energy here. Very, you know, cancer is very sensitive, emotional type energy here. I'm not saying all water signs aren't, you know, Pisces, you know, you are too, as a water baby. But I just feel like your problem here is being able to move forward here. Yeah, speaking your truth, like not helping these people, doing what's best for yourself, for your own success moving forward. All right. Mm. Yeah. And I want to feel like this is kind of you. Like you might, you're going to feel some sort of hurt or sorrow. Somebody's going to try to make you feel bad. And that's what this is all about. It's about, it's mind games, it's mind setups. But you have to understand, yeah, they want to leave you hanging here, Pisces. Okay, that's your energy. They want to keep you caught up about, you know, whether or not you're making the right decisions. But I feel like you know already, these people just want to steal your crown. Okay, the energy here is to cut out these people that you know is playing mind games with you or who you know is flighty, who you know don't mean well. Like, I felt the energy of you needing to go, yeah, they want you to miss out on this opportunity here with this Five of Pentacles. They want you to lose, okay? And it's a it's a new beginning here for you. Could be coming from an Aries type energy. Could be a new job. Uh, going, just adventuring off and doing something new, whatever this energy is. And somebody, they don't want to see you doing it. Five, 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 it's time for you to make a change, Okay. You need to change your dynamic and how you're seeing things and how you're thinking about this. Yeah, have some clarity here. Like, go within yourself. The hermit isn't out here, but I'm feeling that energy. Like, you need to go within yourself and see folks for what they are. Like, I feel like the fool you once, fool you twice type of energy here. Like, you done seen it. These people come back in and boom, you back on your knees. Okay? Yeah, you, it's time for you to set some boundaries. Have some more control here. Be able to move forward. We got Cancer energy out here, Leo energy. Okay. Pisces, you're out here. There we go. People try, they, trying to manipulate you, keep you bound and stuck, not knowing what to do. Okay. Messing with your, your ability to move forward, your ideas. Okay. Making you feel negative about yourself, insecure about yourself, like you're not good enough. You're not good enough to take on these new opportunities. Could be an earth sign doing this. Um, we got magician out here, could be a Virgo, okay, also a Taurus or a Capricorn, but you got the energy, you got the strength to move forward, you, you need to ground yourself, understand something good is coming, and look at that, that make it rain, that's money, okay, that is money, you're the shit, regardless of what these people say, how they want to treat you, what rumors they want to go about, you know you. All right, Pisces, you know you. That's what it is at the end of the day. You know you. So, Spirit, let's close out for our Pisces. They need some attitude. Thank you. Believe what you see. Exactly. Okay? You know people. You know these folks. They don't show you the colors. Face reality or live in La La Land. You choose. Choose bravely. Okay? Choose correct like you already know. And it's time for you to take a trip. All right? 
Like, seriously, get out, get away from these folks, go do something. Go see something, do something new, talk to people who are cooler than you. Get away from these people, these people who claim they love you, that they care about, but you keep pouring in, like, one-sided relationships and stuff like that, okay? And if you think somebody lying, they are, okay? It's time for you to get up out, get out your, get your head out your ass. I've been trying not to cuss, but whatever, get your head out your ass, for real. You need to get by some water or something. It, it's getting nice where I'm at. I'm in New England, so I'm saying get by whatever it is that you can. Get back out in nature and rejuvenate. All right, Pisces? So that has been your message. If you need to book a personal, all that information is listed below. You know your girl is here for it. Oh, and yes, guys, if you made it to the end, stay tuned for the announcement. One year anniversary, guys, I will be giving away free readings. You'll be booking them on the website. That will come out in a video format of how that will go down and all of that stuff will be listed below in that video so stay tuned and i appreciate you guys Mwah! until next time peace out